Okay, let's keep working on this project. Then I have over here uh, photos taken from the library. Actually, like these are these are these are taken from the library, and I think I'm going to use this to <coughs> create this one cohesive, you know, artwork uh, like this. Like that. Let's start. Let's start with that. Okay, so I, I like this color how it kind of plays into that you know that's that looks that looks really nice looks really nice then we're gonna take more layers here's a staircase we kind of overlay it like that we get a very industrial type of texture this is the first try at these photos you know i haven't made any art from that building before there was some kind of you know like you know like draw trolley type of thing with the wheels you know then that's that's like red you know like that's red so if we emphasize that a little bit you know emphasize that a little bit like like this to make it like really red and then then you know I could place it like back there you know like that see how those colors match also and then then we're gonna transparent this layer okay not not yet we're gonna take all of this, save it, and then delete these layers. You have seen me done this many times that I kind of combine layers and then when I can no longer go any deeper, you know, I combine it into one and then I continue on. This is also from the library. Okay, th that picture is kind of, you know, offset, you know, it's actually like, like not straight but we're gonna have to work with that I have quite many photos from there but maybe not enough you know I would need more I'm gonna take more the next time I go there I go there a lot you know I write a lot over there it's fun so yeah we might like change around the color of this you can invent all kinds of things out of that you know like your pose I think libraries in general should be more imaginative you know aren't they the place where the greatest imagination so to say like reside but the buildings are not kind of you know that exciting maybe okay that's that's good that's good then I had this picture out of my out of my clothes I think yeah yeah out of my clothes so let's emphasize that a little bit like illuminati and in god we trust so to say and let's just see what happens when we kind of make this layer a bit transparent let's make that show through just a bit you know can you see it over there? Probably not. Oh yeah, you can. It points to the just exact, you know, almost exact spot where that window ends. So it's perfect. It's perfect. Okay, just like that. Then I have this vision actually of like being a for of being an artist that goes to these you know buildings 
and just gets a permission to like photograph the photograph the place or uh, like take many photographs of it and at, at in the end you know create something like this you know uh, like kind of an artwork that has been made out of the, you know, the building so it kind of well it matches you know to the to the to the place I don't know this one is pretty funny but I don't know if it's finished yet let's let's try to find maybe more more pictures but it's pretty great on its own right now okay so the problem with these photos is that I took them in a kind of a haste you know because because I was just you know going around and you know snapping pictures and I didn't really you know I didn't really like uh, like put an emphasis to like place every every line straight and that kind of stuff so they are kind of you know hit and miss you know these pictures but I I think that that's that's kind of there's something there's something in this that should be like pushed uh, further you know but I think it's kind of ready on its own right now but let's let's just try to like push push it a little bit further you know and let's just you know try to make it a little bit more inter interesting you know visually now it's just you know that kind of well there's a lot of you know abstract shape you know in that building maybe that's why i like it so much because you know you get the all kinds of like things things like that you know isn't that pretty sci-fi you know i think it's pretty sci-fi <laughs> you know and here we have a red like really like distinguished like color difference and i think that's great then then we have this shape it's starting to get a little bit too busy but maybe not you know maybe not uh, no. I'm sure if I showed some of this stuff I actually showed to one of the workers you know they're my art but I didn't yet have any 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 like artworks made out of that you know of the library so yeah again like now like look at that like there's some weirdness going on over here okay like and then there then there was this like christmas like decoration there was this like weird like christmas decoration I think that's like fucking amazingly cool, you know. Buildings are usually very, you know, cohesive as holes, you know, they have been well thought out. And I, I, I wish I could like go to some, you know, buildings that have been, you know, made by world class architects, you know, like the best, you know, it would be in interesting to see what kind of art would come about through those. And that's my kind of my vision that I want to be an artist that would kind of like make art that matches your building, you know. Okay, let's just one more time. Let's just see. If
Like, man, that's so freaking sci-fi. I dig where this is going. Okay. The problem over here is that this is so kind of dark that if we go to this These layers, you know, it comes like, like how would, how would I, I would probably add increase the vibrancy and the saturation a bit, and you know keep the temperature right, and not change the hue, but you know like a little bit more like like just like that. Like, man, that's pretty crazy, you know. Like, that's a completely another world, you know. Like, man, that came about pretty cool. Okay, there's some, there's something in this building that has to be has to be brought out, you know. Like, I, I'm probably the only guy that. They can do that. Let's crop this out again. Yeah. Only like, yeah, I dig that. I haven't yet like in uh, like taken pictures out of human beings, but uh, I don't like it's. Uh, I don't. I'm not saying that I won't do that ever. But at the, at the moment, I'm not doing it because it would be kind of. I could probably obscure it so you would never know who the person like if there was even human being in the picture, but. Okay, like that's. I dig these kind of things, you know, like rhythms. Let's put the land. It's too intense. But the composition over here is just amazingly good, you know. Maybe that's just right. Well, okay, I think I think the I think the one with the crazy colors was the finished piece. Let's look at it. Okay, so this was the first. Uh, the sky, I'm uh, not the sky, the, the roof. Then the staircase, some, you know, things, the wall. Combine those all. The windows, the blinds, some, you know, windows, some decorations. Combine it all like that, like that's really great. 
okay like that's better you know that's better that's much better that's too bland and dark that's just right that's too contrasty it breaks apart so that's that's the final piece and then i kind of experimented <laughs> there is hope yeah there is hope like that so that that's it yeah this will be on my portfolio page go check it out and save it as a wallpaper or something like that thanks for watching